Hey guys and girls, in this tutorial I'm going to be showing you how to reverse a string in Python. Uh, we're going to be using an input, a function, some print statements, and then at the end I'm going to show you a completely different and much easier way to do this. So uh, very quickly we're going to just start and we're going to create a string, um, a variable called string. And this is going to store our word that we want to reverse. And you can just put a message to the user, so you could put um, enter the word that you would like to reverse. Okay, I'm going to create a function, def, I'm going to call this a reverse, and this is just going to be what reverses it, and we're going to pass it that string. And then what we're going to do is we're going to create another variable called a rev string, and this is going to be our reverse string. I'm going to set that to uh, nothing at the moment. It's just going to be an empty variable. And then we're going to create an index variable, index equals, and we're going to set that to the length of our string. And I'll explain why we're doing that in a minute. And then we're going to do a while loop. So while the index is greater than zero, we want it to loop and or iterate, and we want it to do. Uh, we want it to create our reversed string, and to do that, we're going to do a rev string, and we are going to equal rev string to itself, and uh, let's see the string an index of it and it's going to be index minus one and I'll talk you through that so if you imagine a string let's say the name Aaron uh, so if we count those we've got five in there one two three four five so we've got five letters in there and um, what that does is here in this line here we have set index equal to length of string so the index is five so but Python counts from zero so if we look at this we've got one two, three, four, five. If Python counted it, it would be 0, 1, 2, 3, 4. So what we want to do is go, while index is greater than 0, reverse string equals uh, index minus 1. So 5 minus 1 would be 4. So Python would see the n, and it would put the n inside of our rev string. We're then going to do... Um, index equals index minus one and that's going to take one off the index making it four um, and so on and so forth so then it will be four minus one naught one two three which would be the o so at that point it will put the o in and then it will loop again or iterate again and it will uh, put the R, the A, and the A. So then we'll get our word in reverse. So then all we need to do is we're going to return, and we're going to return a red string, and we're going to get rid of Aaron because we don't need that. Okay, and then all we need to do is actually put our code in to run it, and we're just going to do print, and I want it to print uh, reverse. And we're going to pass it string and close the parentheses and that's it so we'll save that and we'll see what happens so assuming we don't have any um, errors and the syntax errors we can uh, click f5 and it runs it says enter the word you would like to reverse so i'm going to enter aaron and there we go, we can see that worked. Now there is a much quicker way of doing this using a uh, extended slice, so I'll show you that now. Okay, so we can see here I've set a, um, the name or string I want uh, to Aaron, and then I'm just printing a slice, an uh, extended slice of that, and I'm gonna explain these in more detail in a later video. Um, you can look it up in the documentation if you want, um, but this will do exactly the same thing as the sort of eight or nine lines of code we just had. So if I run this, so you can see that that's run and it has reversed the name I've uh, 
set in the, into the variable name. Um, thanks for watching. Uh, do like, subscribe and share. And if you'd like a specific tour tutorial on something, uh, please let me know via my Twitter account. Be on the, the link will be on the screen now. Uh, follow me, just request a tutorial and I'll see what I can do to help you out.